Hi everyone, this is Ellie May with Silhouette Secrets Plus and today I wanted to show you how you could export your user designs in individual files. Now, this is a new feature in software versions of B4.4.552 and higher. If you are using older software versions, you will not see this option. I'm going to first show you where to find this. So I'm currently in my user designs folder. Now, the first thing I wanna mention here is that when we do this exporting user designs, it is going to export the entire library structure. So all of these folders, even under my recent downloads, all of my folders where I have moved my different files, it is going to export the folders. However, it will only export the user designs files in the folders that I have created. It does not export any of your Silhouette Design Store files. Those can be recovered from the Silhouette Design Store and this is to protect the designer from people stealing their files. So this is why it does not export all of the files that are including your Silhouette Design Store files. It is designed to export your user created files. So in your library, you do need to be logged in in order to do this. If I click in the top left on my name, if you're on older software, you will see library import and library export only. You will not see this export user created files. Your only option in older software is a library export. The library export is a backup file only. It cannot be opened outside of the Silhouette Studio software and it is, does not contain individual files. It can only be imported back into the Silhouette Studio software if necessary. And I wanna emphasize if necessary because if you import a backup into your Silhouette library, when it is not needed, then you will end up with duplicate files and can have further library issues. In versions 4.4.552 and higher, we now have this export user created files. And I wanna show you what happens when I choose this. So what it's going to do is it's going to export my entire library structure but the only folders that will have files in them are my user created folders, my user created designs. So I'm going to choose export user designs. It's going to ask me where I want to export those to. So I'm going to choose browse computer and I'm going to select my location. So I am going to, I created a folder. I'm going to choose this location where I want it to save to and I'm going to choose select folder. This is telling it the location where I want all of these files to be backed up at. Then I'm going to choose export. And what it's going to do is it's going to show me that it's exporting my full library. However, it is not going to export those Silhouette Design Store files. It will export the folder structure but it will only have the individual files that I have created and saved to my library or files I have placed into my library. So depending on how many files is going to be dependent on how long this takes to process. Each user is going to experience something different. Now, when it's done, it's going to pop up your, your folder where you saved it as, and you're going to see your folder structure. So for instance, here are my designs. You can see I have all of my folders from my library structure. If I were to choose recent downloads, which is where the Silhouette Design Store files are stored, and I go in here, I'm going to see all of these folders, but they are empty. Again, it does not export Silhouette Design Store files. So I'll do that as another example here. Click on that, click on a different topic, it is empty. You could delete this entire folder if you wanted to. If I come down here to User Designs, 
this is where I'm going to see all of my user designs and it is stored as a Silhouette Studio file. So now I have access to all of my Silhouette Studio user created files. If I choose view in my options, I should be able to see the thumbnail image of those Silhouette Studio files as well. You can see how that looks there. Now, if I come back out here to the folder structure and I choose fonts, you're gonna see that I have my folder structure as well. But when I click on that, because they are Silhouette Design Store files, they do not export, just the folder structure does. Same thing with patterns, except I have added patterns to my patterns folder. So they will show up for any of the patterns that I have added personally to that folder. It will not add Silhouette Design Store patterns to this export. And then the recycle bin is empty. So. I hope those tips have helped this give you a little bit of an idea, especially if you have a lot of files stored in the Silhouette Studio Library, I would highly recommend doing a user designs export on a regular basis if you store files to the Silhouette Studio Library. I will have links in the description below on additional tips on organizing and storing your files as well. Thanks for joining me. Have a great day.